Yeah, for sure. I mean, I think that's part of why we're in a little bit of a slump. I think uh, our PK can be better, our power play can be better. And that's the, obviously for me, that's the side I focus on because that's the one I'm on. Um, and uh, really, that's what that's what I boil, boil down to, uh, like five losses in a row. And yet, yesterday we had plenty of chances to make a difference on the power play and we didn't. <clears throat> we didn't. Is there anything specific that you noticed that could be better? Um, well, I think our battle level, our, our breakouts, uh, to be on the same page at times, uh, we weren't uh, skating up the ice together and it's just kind of a waste of 20 seconds because it's probably going to come back down the ice uh, and that matters a lot. Uh, it gives confidence to the other team uh, to, to stand up at the blue line, all that, that stuff. I think in zone's been somewhat fine. We've had a lot of chances. Uh, sometimes they go in, they, sometimes they don't, but uh, part of it is is on us on the face-offs to, uh, to battle more. Newsy talked last night after the game just how important it is to get these practice days in because you don't get many of them throughout the season and you guys worked heavily on special teams today. How important is that for you? Yeah, no, it is for sure. Like, like I said, the uh, Yesterday on the power play again, we got scored on. Our PK got scored a couple, maybe three. It's been a theme the last five games, so I think we got to win the special team battles for sure. And just a quick comment on Jonathan Berger, and you've been playing with him a little bit more, and his role has been expanding. What do you think of him as a player? Yeah, he's a good player. Uh, sees the ice very well, makes a lot of plays out there. He's starting to get a time on the power play because of that too, and I, I thought he's uh, played good hockey ever since he came up. I don't know how many games it's been now, but... He's certainly making a difference for us out there, and uh, we want him to, to keep getting better. You played a lot against Ovechkin out yeah. there in your career, and now that he's making history here, and after all these years, it's still as dangerous as ever. Just, what are the yeah, it's pretty special to, to see it happen. Uh, I think anybody, when he starts in the, whenever it was, like 05, 06, whenever he started, um, he still changed his style of play a little bit from then. He was running around a lot more, being a lot more physical. He still does at times, like trust me in playoffs, I, I've been on the other, other side of it a couple of hits and uh, it's, it's not easy. But he's also uh, found a way to be consistent, scoring his goals obviously in the power play, but he, he does it in different ways too now. So it's uh, pretty amazing what he's doing and in a way I think uh, like we're all kind of cheering for him a little bit. I, as far as down the road, if he can beat that record, I think it'd be uh, a cool thing for the league, uh, certainly a record that uh, 10 years ago no one saw that it could ever be broken.